Hello, welcome to ignani.com. How to disable lock screen in Windows 8. The lock screen is what you first see when you start your PC, laptop or a tablet. There's a lot more to the lock screen than it meets the eye. It tells you the date and time, and a variety of other information like event updates from your calendar, mail notifications, and other app notifications and updates. If you are using a Windows 8 tablet, you might find the lock screen useful for all its notifications. But if you are using a PC or a laptop, then you would like to get into action without the lock screen. Though you can disable the lock screen pretty easily, Microsoft has hidden the option, and has not made it easy for users to find it. In this how-to video, I will show you how you can disable the lock screen in few simple steps. How to disable the lock screen using, Local Group Policy Editor. Press Windows key plus R to open the run bar. Type gpedit.msc, and press enter, or click OK. The Local Policy Editor launches. Another approach is to use, Apps Search. Press Windows key plus Q. And type gpedit.msc and click on the gpedit.msc icon that appears in the search result. You will be presented with the local group policy editor. Go to computer configuration. Administrative templates. Control panel, and personalization. Double click the setting, do not display the lock screen. This will open up the dialog box. Select, Enabled. Then press Enter, or click OK. Exit the local policy editor and reboot if required. The next time you restart or wake up your PC or laptop, you won't see the lock screen. Instead, you will be directly taken to the logging screen. Now, let's try an alternate method using Windows 8 registry hack. The local policy editor comes only with Windows 8 Pro, and Windows 8 Enterprise, but you can still disable the lock screen, using Windows 8 Registry Editor. How to disable the lock screen, using Windows 8 Registry Editor. Press, Windows key plus Q. Which will open the search bar. Enter, regedit, and click on the regedit.exe icon that appears in the search result. This will open the registry editor. Another alternate approach is to press Windows key plus R, which will open the run dialog box. Enter, regedit, and press enter, or click OK. In the registry editor, go to H key underscore local underscore machine, software, policies, Microsoft, Windows, and personalization. Create a D word called, no lock screen if it doesn't exist. Since we just disabled the lock screen from the local group policy editor, the no lock screen value will be 1. Now you can change its value from 1 to 0, which will enable it back. If you want to disable the lock screen, then you can change the value to 1. Exit the registry editor and restart Windows 8. Sometimes you may not see the personalization key. Don't worry, just create it before creating the no lock screen D word. That's it about enabling and disabling the lock screen in Windows 8. You can find a lot of free video tutorials, training materials, how to videos, and much much more at our site www.ignani.com. Post all your questions at our site. We will be happy to help you. We want your learning process to be as interactive as possible. Feel free to contact us.